this just piles on uh, to the problem and some of the recovery that those children will have to face. You know, Jesse, we see change sometimes occur when horrible things happen, right? I would hope that this would be the kind of case that would lead to change in how foster care works. I mean, it, the, look, it's so such a cliche to just say, oh, you know, this never should have happened. But you just can't imagine it. It's like, you're like, are you joking? In, in this situation with these kids who've been through this, they allow this to happen with a foster family? I mean, there has just got to be a way to fundamentally alter the foster care system. Unfortunately, I think you have more faith in it because I've covered a number of cases where it's foster care parents and we keep having that conversation. I tell you, when I first heard about this, at first I thought it was more allegations against the Turpins. I was shocked to see that it's the family that they're now staying with. And, and there's a problem. There's clearly a problem. If it's not background checks, it's not fully understand because they, they didn't just abuse the Turpins. They had more children in their care as well that were abused. And why this was going on and why it took something like this for them to be brought to justice, I, I just, I don't have an answer for it. I wish I did. Yeah. Um, all right, well, look, you know, I kind of want to move on because this is just so infuriating and upsetting. And there's nothing else to say except for we failed you, um, Turpin family. And on behalf of our legal system, I'm sorry. This is just unacceptable. And, uh, you know, I want to keep looking into this story to figure out how this happened. And uh, let's, let's think about doing a segment on this next week about how the foster care system completely failed here. Kelly Beeson, thank you very much for coming on the show. Appreciate it. Jesse Weber, as always, appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.